Peace of Christ to all. In this video, we will listen to this guy. His name is Zachariah Naik. I'm not going to play his video so nobody can accuse us of a copyright issue, but we will hear his voice. I will show you how Muslims, as usual, do lie. Let us hear. Any book to claim that it is a revelation from Almighty God, it should stand the test of time. 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 The other points. Brother William Campbell raised was regarding Surah Kahf, chapter number 18, verse number 86, that Zulkar name sees the sun setting in murky water, in turbid water. Imagine sun setting in murky water, unscientific. The Arabic word used here is, it is wajada, meaning it appeared to Zulkar name. And not to William. <laughs> the word wajada, its mean appear to the Karnain. Uh, by the way, and here he is talking about Alexander the Great, in case you don't know. Alexander the Great, according to the Quran, is a Muslim prophet. And all of you guys, uh, I don't know if you know, that Alexander the Great, he was a gay. Gay. But Muhammad, anyone, he was famous, he want to put his name in the Quran as a prophet. If Hitler was exist, you will find his name in the Quran, trust me. If a Britney you know, a spear was exist in the time of Muhammad, he will talk about, about her in the Quran. But now, let us expose his lie. This is the word Wajadaha. And this is the Muslim translation. He said, Wajadaha mean appear. Appear. If it's mean appear, why you translate it as he found it not appear? You see how they lie? Even in your translation, which I don't approve even, it's saying it clearly, he found it set in a spring of murky water. Liar, and your nose is big. Now we will do the following. We will go to the dictionary and see in the dictionary if that word wajadaha can be even close to anything have to do with appear to. Huh? Let us go and see. This is the word we are talking about. Wajada. Find, find out, discover, strike upon, stumble upon, a light. Deem, discover. That's it. The second word is not the same. This is a different word. So, where it says, and how it can be, when all the meaning of the word is coming as we see. As he found out or he found something have nothing to do with appear or appearance now we can prove that even more better by the following this is Ibn Abbas one of the biggest scholars of Islam as you see this is your Islamic website not mine because Muslims they will say see he is explained by him himself as usual when he reached the sitting place of the Sun it's not about when he reached where it's appear do you see it? When he reached, it's a location. The sitting place of the sun. Where the sun set. He found it sitting in a muddy spring. Listen carefully. It doesn't say it's appeared to him. You see how, you know, man, those people, honestly, honestly, I feel sorry for Islam because of those people which mean you know Satan I'm sure Satan is not happy with those guys those you know Satan is hiring the bad people to do it to do a job because now they are helping us to expose them more even where in there it says it's appear to be it's very clear he reached a place where the Sun sitting and he found it listen listen read carefully guys he found it sitting in a muddy spring you see it he found it not appear to him and you know the, the proof that this is not it's not about appear appearance because Alexander the Great you know uh, uh, the sea is all over in front of him he is coming from Rome he is coming from a Greek he is coming from Europe and we know like it's not it's you know what it's mean he arrived until he found the sun 
sitting in the, in the murky water. If it's about the ocean, listen carefully, if it's about the ocean, well, he see that every day. He see that every day. If it's about different place, it's mean the verse is talking here that he reached to a place where nobody been before except him and not only that he found be there people who they are not believers and they look even weird if you read the explanation and here in English you don't see it they look so weird and you will see and he found people next to that hot spring look, look at this and also say that it is it, it this is mean a hot spring and found people there about this their people were disbeliever we said uh, I don't know what this word even mean we inspired him either punish either kill them why just because they don't believe look look you know look look the fruit of Islam so Allah order Alexander the Great when he found those people where the sun set huh? so it's a location nothing is about appearance he found people who they are not a believer and Allah he told them inspire him look at the word inspire this is a proof that he is a, a prophet so Allah he inspire him either punish or kill them until they accept to believe of Allah so even Alexander the Great all the wars he was doing he was just fighting for Allah come on you see this is the science of Islam and you know history history is written in here so this guy when he said that the word wajadaha it's mean appear to he is just a liar talking about uh, where the sun set and etc and the, the murky water I wanted to share with you uh, from the same sources which is Ibn Abbas you know the, it says in here they ask Ibn Abbas and Ibn Abbas don't speak for himself he speak only what the Prophet told him because he's not a prophet you know this guy he is one of the best of the best of the best of the best of the scholars in Islam this is the top they ask him if you read him in here you will see he is saying he, you know he was asked you know how you explain to us the low tide and the high tide of the ocean or the sea he said listen to this listen to the science of Islam he said there is an angel you see the word in red this is an angel he is in charge of the dictionary of the sea dictionary of the sea which means in the book of the sea if he put his leg or his foot on it the tide go high if he take it off the tide go low science if we take this and we post it in Google Translation, I, I will I will post the link next to it so you can do it by yourself or you can search on the internet for the, you know for one in English because I, I could not find uh, uh, Musnad Ahmad in English. If you can find it, you know this is the hadith in front of you, or you can take and copy the the text as it is, copy it to Google Translation, post it, and you will see it by yourself. I will post the link next to it. So you know, uh, 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 and if you by the way, if you go and read. Uh, those uh, th th this verse in Ibn Kathir or in any book you know in Arabic is going to be totally different from the way it is in English if you go in English you will see it's only two line the long line is going to be just two lines in English why because they have to cut it off they have to make it look better so they change everything so you will see uh, 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 you know uh, uh, they say it appear as if it is as if it is when the Quran never say as if it is and the proof is very easy you know the proof in front of our eyes I challenge any Muslim to show me from where they get the word as if it is so always I advise people not to go by the Islamic ex is tra translation not explanation you know I, I take Islamic explanation to see because you want to know what those people believe in this is the point but if you go by the translation Muslims will never be honest Muslims are allowed to lie to promote Islam as surah 3 verse 28 if you ask Muslims about it they will say yeah this surah is allowed in us to lie in the case of war well let me tell you something 
Don't make Muslims fool you. Isn't it true that in Islam, the word for them is two word, two land, the land of peace and the land of war. Which one is the land of peace? Is the one is under the control of Islam. The one is not under the control of Islam is the land of war, which mean if he is living in America, this is the land of war. If he live in England, this is the land of war. If he live in Australia, this is the land of war. If he live in Europe, this is the land of war. So he's allowed to lie to, as a protection. He's protecting Islam. This is protection for them. It is, it's not about really the war you think. For them, even you as a neighbor, you are in war with them because simply you rejected Islam, you don't accept Allah. This is how Islam, be aware, be careful. Jesus is Lord, Islam is false, I mean.